Hello everybody, here we are once again with John Collins from Ace Electrical Training, doing some on-site testing using the new individual testers from QTech, these small compact ones. We'll start off using the KT500, which is the RCD tester. So we'll run a short demonstration testing an RCBO unit in this board here. It's a Type AC unit, and if you look at the tester, you'll see you've got Type A, Type AC, and there's Type S. So we'll be using the Type AC side there, and we're going to be doing it in the auto mode because it's a 30 milliamp. Okay, so let's have a go. We've got a small magnetic uh, little holder there, so we've put that on like so. And as you can see, it holds the test nicely in place. I'll just move it to the side, just so you can see when I'm making the connections. As you can see, we've got the earth connection on the DBMET already. So I'll turn the tester on, put it into AC on the 30 milliamp also. All the loads have been disconnected, so there's nothing connecting into the circuit. The CPCs onto the, the earth, we'll put onto the uh, blue probe onto our neutral, brown onto the line. And as we can see, displaying the voltage there, 224, 223, all we simply have to do, because in the auto mode, is press the test. It'll go through the six tests, which is times half, 0 180 degrees, times one, 0 180. And because it's a 30 milliamp, uh, we'll do a times five for additional protection. So it's going through the sequence. There's the first one, it's trips, so that's a times one. It's always best to give it two seconds. Wait a couple of seconds before you reset it. So turn it back on. That's the second time. There's the third, so we're into the times five. And there's the fourth time. What you should always do when it's done the fourth trip is turn it back on and do a functional test. It's as simple as that. When you're taking them off, the line, then the neutral, and last but not least, the earth connection. Okay, recording the times then. If you look at the instrument itself, you'll see you've got a record button there. So you simply just press it, so it displays there. At the top, you can see the times off, giving you the different half of the sine wave, so it's no trip. No trip in two seconds, which is 2,000 milliseconds, indicating the pass. There's the other half of the sine wave, then times one, we've got 19.2, so you just say 20 or you've got 29, which is 30, so we'd record for times one 30. Then times five, again, it's 20 or 30, so it's 30 for times one and 30 for times five. And it's as simple as that, folks. So there you have testing a type AC, RCB at 30 milliamp, with a new QTEC KT500. Remember, folks, Johnny Ace is on the case.